So you're new to Adidas. Yeah. What was it about the brand that appealed to you? Um, for me, to get approached by a, a brand like Adidas is, is a massive achievement. Like again, I've probably said achievement about 10 times no, since I got in the car. Yeah, we've but... counted this quite a lot. <laughs> Uh, but for me, I love I love the casual wear. The trainers are very comfortable, and so are the boots. Mm. Um, so it was kind of a when you get offered something like that, you don't you don't refuse brand, it. Yeah. yeah, it's a second to none kind of thing. It's like, yep, no worries. It's a yeah. massive uh, honour, not an achievement. It's an honour. <laughs> Gonna have to think of different <laughs> words. You've been wearing the Kakari lights. I have, mate. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. How are very you finding those? Very oh, they're very light. <laughs> I mean, I'm wearing a pair too. They are oh, yeah. very light. Yeah. Who's you wear for? Newton Abbott RFC. <sighs> Unbelievable rugby team there. Yeah, tell me about it. We've, we're two from two. I mean, if you want to say, if you want to say anything to the new shout team, out to Newton Abbott Rugby Club. Keep going, boys. Put Jared in the second team. No, sorry, what? <laughs> yeah, no, the Kakari whites for me are probably. I think they're in like, they are a back row boot. So obviously I'm a back rower. If you mm. didn't know, so yeah, it's kind of ideal, really. Yeah. Very light. Nice and light. Um, yeah. And the colour? Yeah, I've gone for the, the, the blue and black pair, but I'm, I'm more than happy to wear white if. <laughs> if Adidas yeah. wanted to send them a <laughs> oh. So the latest Adidas campaign is hashtag next is everything. What are your goals for the upcoming season? Uh, Personal goals? For me, it's just continue to learn. Uh, I'm just, like I said, I'm only 20, so I've got to keep pushing on hmm. um, and learn from the likes of Tui Faltao and uh, them, uh, them sort. Um, but for me, yeah, uh, find a regular place in the first team at Bath and just try and get in there and cement my place there. But that's yeah. going to be by training well and showing when I get my opportunities that I take it. And, and then whatever happens after that will happen. Yeah. Uh, obviously, everyone's aspirations is to go and play international rugby. Yeah. Um, so all I've got to do is get into the Bath first team first by working hard and learning. Um, and like I said, take my opportunity and then hopefully other opportunities will arise from that. Yeah. We understand you're a big name on campus. <laughs> Where'd you get that from? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently that's one of your nicknames, is, is that it? correct? What? Beanock. Where, where did that, yeah. Beanock, so where did that come from? Uh, yeah, it's an interesting story mate, to be honest. So I was in my uh, upper sixth year at Merkiston Castle School in Edinburgh. Very good rugby school if Shout anyone out. fancies it. Um, yeah, so I was there for two years and uh, I think it was a rugby world thing. I ended up winning uh, player of the month or something. Right. Uh, and in the magazine it said Beanock. And for that, I just kind of got my, the mic taken out of me at school, really. And it just stuck. None of the Bath boys know, so I really hope they don't see this video. They are, I mean, as I said, I'm best friends with Anthony Watson, so I'm probably going to send him <laughs> a little Snapchat. Send him a little message. A little Snapchat. A little Snapchat. Yeah. No, do you have any Snapchat? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's Anthony Watson 15 or something. Is it really? <laughs> Very unique. Well, so there we go, guys. Adam. I'm joking, it's not. Yeah, it's not. Me. I actually don't know what it is. Me and Anthony don't get on that well, you see. <laughs> So you're referred to as one of the most prized assets in English rugby. Who said that? Well, it's on your Bath profile. <laughs> well, so, I don't know who writes them. But what's your most prized asset? My chat. Really? No. Because, uh, I mean, your chat's not very good. To be honest, my pro in a rugby relation or just anything? Just anything. Um, for me, probably uh, the ability just to talk to anyone and get on with anyone. Um, like, I'm, I don't really get nervous. I'm quite a confident individual when, it, when I want to be and when I have to be. So, yeah, I'll probably say that it's up there. Yeah. Uh, like, me, I've, I've only met you 10 minutes ago. You just picked me off the street. Right? <laughs> Brilliant. So we just kicked person. Anthony Watson yeah, out. Yeah, and then we're best mates, Jared, you know? We are best mates. Like Newton Abbott Rugby. We Club, follow each other on Instagram. I don't, I don't know if I follow you, do I? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, on, but yeah, after we get this, I will give you a cheeky follow. No, no, you don't have to. Okay, I mean, I'm not, I'm not begging for followers yet. I won't, but seriously, it's Jerry <laughs> Seven. <laughs> yeah, so that's all. Yeah, yeah. Well, thanks for chatting to us. No, it's fine, mate. It's been a real privilege, actually. Yeah, it's um, nice to meet you. Yeah. And I'm sure we good will night. be good friends for a long time. Yeah. Free tickets? Uh, I think Anthony's your best bet there, mate. I'm just going to nip in there quickly. <laughs> that's all right. Yeah, that's all. Oh, wow. Little tiny, tiny cheeky sunburn.